Louisa, thank you so much for speaking to us today. It's been very busy outside. We've actually had to come into this quiet space in the same space covered. Um, but I'd like to start by asking you, how different is it performing on stage to performing on screen? Because many of us know you from The Bill, from EastEnders, and of course from American Pie. Which do you prefer? Which is more challenging? Um, I don't know what I prefer. You get a different feeling out of performing on stage. I mean, Panto is for the children. Um, and it's a Christmas, you know, period, so it's all fun and games. But performing sort of theatre, um, you just get an, a, a, an immediate reaction. Whereas TV, it's, it's, it's totally different. Did any of the moves you learned on Strictly help you out of this performance? And is it quite a dance-heavy role, Cinderella? Uh, yeah, it is, which is really nice, because normally I play Peter Pan, so there's not much dancing involved. But this time, Cinderella playing Fimo, I've been, a been able to do a lot of dancing. We have a sh massive Strictly number, which is great as well. Now, the last one I'm going to talk about, the Lisa May Foundation. We're supporting the performance on the 27th yeah. of this one. What is the importance of supporting charity this time? Because sometimes it's very easy to come in here, buy loads of lovely things for our family Christmas years, and go see the pantomime, but sometimes forget about charity. Why is it important to support these good causes, particularly this time of year? Um, I think the reason it's good to support a charity like this is because it's it's not mainstream, it's not a huge charity at the moment and I think that's where we like, as a nation go wrong, we're, we're constantly supporting these huge char charities and all the others that are forgotten about so it's nice to be able to bring it into something like a Sainsbury's um, and to show a lot of people that probably would have never heard of it and just to sort of teach people what it's about. Now, last question, slightly cheeky, on a good note. Getting so into the head of Cinderella, is there ever the danger you might fall for the Prince Charming, your romantic lead? No, because we're both taken, so that's a shame, isn't it? <laughs> well, Louisa, thank you so much. We, I can't wait to see you. Thank you so much for talking to us today and supporting the Lisa Mayfair. Thank you.